the monitoring spirits are looking for you. They want to take your energy. They can't take your energy. They can't get around you no more. Don't give them your energy. They can't access your energy. They can't find you. Don't give them your energy. The Most High is with you. Always. You were too good for them. They can't get your energy. Don't give them your energy. Don't go around the energy vampires. Take your energy back. Keep it to yourself. Don't allow people to drain you from your energy. Don't go down on their level. Go back. Keep it to yourself. Then you gain your power, your strength, your joy, your happiness. And these monitoring spirits, they monitor your moves. They be the closest one to you. They watch you when you don't look. When you don't pay attention, they pay attention. They look at you. Waiting to pull you down. They try to take your high frequency down. They try to get your energy. Because they are low vibrational. They become weak without you. Your energy is powerful. So keep it up. Keep it to yourself. You make them feel better. When I get into your presence, because your presence, the energy is... They get an energy boost for bringing you down. Projecting their fears on you. Their insecurity. Attacking you, bringing up your past. Trying to take you down. Pray. And don't let people have access to your energy. Your energy is gold. You feel weak. You feel drained. When you talk with them. When you leave them. Fuck what they say. It's about you. Tell yourself good things. You can be your own worst enemy. And don't go around this energy vampires. This monitoring spirits. Don't allow them to take it onto you. They're not confident. They can't go to the next level themselves. Separate yourself from them. You can't be around these people. They only drain your energy. They don't give your energy. They are around you to take your energy. Listen to your heart, to your discernment. Your intuition will tell you, don't go around them. You will feel something strange. If you feel something weird, then back off. Because they are monitoring spirits. They come as friends, family, to get information. You feel sorry, you feel bad. If you don't go around them, 
Maybe you feel bad because you have memories together. They are your friends, your family, but they showed they show you that they they are monitoring spirits, that they are jealous of you. They just want you down. They show you who them are. They can't figure out your next move. They don't know what you do. They're gonna be anxious because they don't know you. They don't know what you do. They are suffering. They don't got no energy to pull them. They are dying. They are weak. Your enemies are dying slowly. The monitoring spirits. They go around and they take energy from people. God gave you the energy inside of you you feel something weird how they move how they monitor fuck them god put it on the inside of you you have the power you have the energy you have the strength you have it inside of yourself you have it they need your energy to make it to the next level they need your energy to make it you make them better why are you by yourself because you can't be around them you have to resist the devil put on the whole armor of God the monitoring spirits are out there in the world they monitor in real life on social media it's a small world. Haters everywhere. You're gonna see these spirits, but you always have God pray every day, all the time. When you wake up, when you go to sleep, tell God to cover you with your angels. Ask God to protect you, your energy. Our angels, they guard. <coughs> you have to stay in prayer. Lord, help me. Show me the way. Give me strength. Help me on the right path. God leads us left right in the right path these monitoring spirits they know how to play they play like they are for you that they're gonna support you they're gonna be there for you they like you but they be the same people that stab you in the back they see you winning. Now they ask about your business. You have to be careful what you tell these spirits and who you surround yourself around. They try to figure you out. How do you winning? How do you live? How do you get money? How do you do this? How do you do that? What are you doing? They try to figure out things about you, but they are not glad, happy for you. How do you win alone? We are alone here in the streets. We ain't lonely. God is always here. They are lonely. They lost a chosen one. They lost a real one. The Holy Spirit is always with us, everywhere, around here. The monitoring spirits, they are losing. They don't worship God like you worship God. They don't pray to God. They don't read the Bible. They have demonic spirits inside of them. Jealous, envious, 
gang stalking spirits, hating spirit, confusion. They are not in the spirit of God. They are from the devil. You will see the signs from them. They watch, they stalk, they look, they monitor. They know you the light surrounded by darkness. You got the supernatural power. You are anointed. You are chosen. They are not. They stink. They are dark. Your enemies are your family. Your friends. They never like. But they watch. They never, ever, ever, ever support you. They come into your like life as a support ship angel, as someone who like you, that's family, that's friends, that's for you. But when it comes to the real shit, they ain't there. They don't have your back. Your Holy Spirit disturb their demons. Their eyes start to go like this. Sometimes they do like this. Uh, like robots. They are jealous of you. When they monitor you. When they watch you. They can't stand the fact that you winning. That you get to the money, the paper. So when they see you in real life, they get so excited. The misery loves company. If they ain't doing good, if they monitor you, they want to be like you. If they monitor you, they want to be like you. If they gang stalk you, if they hate on you, if they try to take your energy they can't do it without you they can't do it like you do it they try to copy you copycats mimic they want to be like you but they can't be like you they can't copy the anointing that's why they watch you they watch you but they don't say nothing they watch this video, what I put out, but they don't like. Every time they monitor, you're always winning. You always get to the next level. Don't go back. If you go back to them, they want to take your energy. You have to be careful who you surround yourself around who you take into your life energy is energy it's important these monitoring spirits they have negative energy they are low vibrational they don't got nothing better to do than to watch you to monitor you and to pray on your downfall throw their insecurities their hate their negativity on you project their fear on you because they are afraid to go out there and doing something fake you gotta move all the time you got to pray they will never find you because God hides you They wish they can get close to you. It doesn't matter how you look. It's all about the energy you carry on. You look good. You have the personality. You have the aura. You have the spirit. You have the energy. The energy you have, they don't have. It makes the person. It makes you. You are a powerful person. 
They feed off your energy. They get strength by being your prisons. They get stronger, you get weaker. Because they are energy vampires. And when they can't get your energy, they get mad. Crazy. Aggressive. They are miserable. They are down. They want you to go down with them. Pull your energy back. Cut them all off. It's the best you can do. Be by yourself. My energy is best. To get to the next level, I have to protect my energy. I have to be by myself. I'm all the way up. Remove yourself. Now I feel good. Now I got my strength back. Now I am myself. Now I'm feeling good. Everyone was just in my life to monitor, to take our energy. We're spiritual beings. We do not wrestle against flesh and blood. It's a spiritual warfare, a battle every day. It's a battle against the devil. <sighs> they want your energy, they want your spirit. The spirit you have is strong. And they are jealous of you because they don't have the energy. They do anything to pull you down. They want to destroy you. They want to break you. They want to kill you. The devil don't care. He don't care if it's your own parents, your friends. The devil jumps inside of anybody to go against you. It's the enemy working inside of these people. These monitoring spirits, they don't worship God. They don't love God like you. They don't have the heart like you. They don't ask God. They don't pray. These monitoring spirits, they don't love God. They talk, but they don't really love God. If they really love God, they wouldn't be monitoring you, watching you. They will understand. They will do it themselves. It's spirits they have. Low vibrational entities. Energy vampires. They suck you dry. They drain you. Till they can't drain you no more. And they take your energy. And how do they drain you of your energy? They put you down. Telling you that you can't do it. Trying to dim your light. You are the light surrounded by darkness. They want to take you down. They throw in shades on your success. They hate. Try to make you feel like you ain't doing it. When you do better than them. When they realize that you are doing better. They start to monitor. They gang stalk. They try to keep you down on their level. They're getting anxious and angry. Because they don't have access to your energy. They want to get you down. Because you're up. They're gonna die in misery. They're gonna die being a nobody. You're gonna die being a somebody. 
Who want to be low vibrational? Every time you come around, you know they are monitoring spirits. You know they watch you behind the scenes. Demonic spirits. They have jealous demonic spirits, envious spirits, dark spirits. You're gonna feel it when you get into their presence. You're gonna feel it directly. Bam! How they look, look in their eyes. They're dark. Resist the devil and he's gonna flee. Resist him. So all the shows and ones, be by yourself. They can't find you no more. They can't get to you. They can't figure you out. You're too strong now. They don't know where you are. Don't tell them. They ask funny questions. What are you doing? Where do you stay? Act like a fool. Don't answer. If they want to play, play them back. They don't got your best interest. When they ask, don't say nothing. Don't answer. When they call, they try to get you. When they call you, it can be energy in a phone call, in a message. You can feel it when you talk to them on the phone. You talk and you feel weird. You get awkward. Something weird. You know why? Because they tried to pull you down. They monitor you, they watch you. So if you watch this video, monitoring spirits, don't call me no more. You can feel it. When you talk to a stranger, the energy can be all the way up. But when you talk to someone, you want to see them win. They want to see you win. They act like they don't want to see you win, but they don't want to see you win. The handshake is fake, like this. It's not real. If they were real, the handshake will be real. Don't even shake their hands. Don't even look. They get quiet when you come around. You don't need to touch their hands. You don't need to talk to them. You don't need to look at them. Ignore them all. They should be celebrating you. They should clap for you. They should be happy for you. But they want to feed off you. They want that energy. Your energy is the best. Your energy is not free. They need to pay to get your energy. If they want my energy, they need to pay. <sighs> they should pay to be around you. Energy is important. Very important. You have the energy. You make other people do better. You get your energy from God. I get my energy from Jesus Christ, from God. Okay? You can help them. He's my strength. We make people come up. Have positive energy. Dominant. It's the Holy Spirit. 
Every time you pray, God gives you strength, okay? We are prayer warriors. All we have been through, we have been down, I've been down. I got on my knees, I say, Amen. Keep pushing, destroy them. Attack from left and right. You gotta pray. You gotta have a cross here. Everywhere you go, protect your spirit, protect your energy. Don't allow people to have uh, access to energy through handshake, hug, talk to them. Their negative energy can jump over on you. Don't touch them, don't talk to them. It's scary. You turn around, they look. They're coming out of nowhere. Left, right. They come in strange places. Hello, how are you? How do they know where you are? How do they know? They want to get information. They try to get information from you. You have to cut them off. Don't call them, don't talk to them. Pull your energy back. You don't need them to get a boost. They need us. They don't boost us. You're around and you wanna sleep. They make you tired. Shit, man. They are in secret competition with you. They make us tired. I love to keep up my energy and keep in my flow. You look at them as friends, as family. That's my best, best friend. They look at you as competition. And they can't compete with your energy. Your anointing. It's in you. And they can't take it from you. <sighs> Pay attention to the word they say, how they treat you. It's not about what they say, how they think. It's about what you think about yourself. What do you tell yourself? Tell yourself that you are good. Tell, tell yourself that you are strong. Don't let them project their fears and their insecurity and their hate on you. The devil is a liar. I am more than a conqueror. I am destined for greatness. I have God inside of myself. We are the next big thing. We are the fighters. We are the chosen. They pull on your energy to get an energy boost by putting you down, discouraging you, hating on you, being jealous of you, being envious. You can smell the envy. They tell you what you should do with your life and how you should do it. How good you are. You know that you are good. You are the best. I know who I am. I'm the best in God. I walk into my calling. how I want when people throw shit on you try to dim your light telling you what you are doing what you are not doing and how you are doing they are a monitoring spirit they watch you win they monitor you they watch you on social media they watch you in real life you don't see them but they see you. 
They think they're smart. And they can't beat you. They can't compete with you. Because you are in your purpose. You are in your calling. I am in my calling. And they can't beat me. They can't tell me to do other things. I listen here. I listen to God. When God called me, I take up. They are jealous. They do anything to bring you down. You can't give them your heart. You can't give them your love. You can't help them. Instead of saying, I see what you do. I'm happy for you. What you are doing is really good. You inspire me. You are a good person. I like what you do. I like you. And keep on pushing. Keep on doing what you do. Uh, you are the one. You are great. They can't say that. They try to destroy you. What do monitoring spirits do? They want you to go the other path. The bad path. They don't want you to follow the good path. They want you to fit in their life. They don't got nothing going on. Stay away. Protect your energy. Stay away from the toxic people. Resist the devil and he will flee. Stay away from toxic people. Keep it by yourself. You're going to go higher and higher and higher. And you're going to climb up. So protect your energy chosen ones. You're going to need it. God takes us to a new level. You have to keep all your energy. Don't let them see you down. Don't let them throw their insecurities on you. Don't let them bring you down. Go up. Stand strong. Go forward. They come into your life. They support. As a friend. They support. But then. They help you. But they try to destroy you. You can feel it on them. They're jealous. They're envious. They're not real. I respect people who tell. Tell that they are jealous. And that they don't like you. They don't like your spirit. Okay if they tell you. But they fake it. They don't like you and they fake that they like you. They pretend like they love you. When they hate you. Pretend like they're going to support you. But when you turn your back, they stab you in the back. When your guard go down, they attack you. Bring up your past. Bring up your negativity. When you go back to these people, if you go back to them, they're going to destroy you. They used to want to destroy you. If you hang out with them, they're going to lash out. They're going to bring you down, picking fights, give you drugs to keep you down. And then they laugh. They want to be like you. So they monitor. We are the chosen. We are the real ones. They are fake. They monitor you because they want to be like you. They copy what you do. They wish they had your energy, but they don't have. God did not give the energy. They don't have the energy. You have the energy. God didn't give them the energy. God gave you the energy. They shit on you. When you was down. When they was up and you was down, they show you what they felt about you. They made fun of you. They mistreat you. They hate on you. They knew your struggle, knew your story. They didn't offer you a room, food. 
they was greedy. They monitor you when you were struggling. Now you are up. If you see people down, you take them up. We are struggling. We fight. But one day, God will take us up. God is working for us. God is helping us. Every day, one day, we will make it. They know. Everybody that didn't take advantage of you. Now, everybody that take advantage of you. They didn't appreciate your energy, your presence, you as a person. They don't deserve you. They are suffering. They don't got no strength. They don't got no willpower. They don't got no energy. They watch in a bad way. They started to talk like you, dress like you, be like you. They want to be like us. We have to take our energy back. Your intuition will tell you something about these people. They want your life. They want to be like you. They monitor you. They want your life. They want what you have. They want your spirit. But they can't have it. And they didn't go through what you go through and they realize they can't have your spirit they can have your energy they can't be like you and they will try to destroy you if they can't be like you they do anything to steal your power to take you down they want to bring you down to the ground so don't go down on the enemy's level don't make room for the enemy to come in. Move around, move fast. Hide, run. They try to find your energy. They try to take your energy. They are dying in misery. Misery loves company. Don't give them your energy. Keep your energy and your frequency high. Keep elevating. Stay blessed.